Hey, water signs. How are you guys? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We are um, going to do a live here on the channel tomorrow, March 20th. This video is for March 20th. So if you're watching this video on March 20th, the live is 10 a.m. on Eastern Time. It's going to turn into a regular video after I go live. And I'll be talking about the equinox, which is happening tomorrow at that time. Equal day, equal night, balance of light and dark. And I'm going to be doing a live reading, um, and it's about abundance and all things moving forward as on the 21st we move into Aries, and this is the beginning of the Zodiac. So this is about abundance and all things. So I'm going to do, um, as an extended, I'm recording some things today for each of the Zodiac. Um, so after you watch the live, you can check that out. Okay, okay, there'll be a link, and I'll make sure I tell everybody. Okay, so welcome in for you guys, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I saw you guys in the air reading today, and it may or may not resonate with you. If this reading doesn't resonate with you, you might want to check that one out. Okay, so let's see here. Three of Pentacles, working it out. Definitely working it out or working towards something that you want. Seven of Pentacles, Three of Cups. Wow. Okay. So somebody you're connected with. Oof. Okay. You're going to get what you want here, dudes, but um interesting here. There's some there's some um cheating energy here. Or let's see here, overarching energy of this reading because I got 3 of pentacles, 3 of cups, and then the empress, 7 of swords. Six of Wands, you overcoming this. Okay, so the person you're dealing with is like per perfectly happy with what you have. Um, seven of Pentacles, Three of Cups, Four of Wands. They're perfectly happy because they might have a third party. So they're not really doing anything. They're just like sitting, standing still. And it, Things don't stand still, okay? Things do not stand still. So I feel like this is you here. Ten of Swords, King of Cups, Seven of Swords. I feel like you're like, I'm kind of done with this. I feel stuck. I not. Um, I feel betrayed. If, if you found out about a third party, you feel betrayed by that. Overcoming it. I really like this. Overcoming it. You're going to get what you want. Nine of Cups, blocking that other person and bringing in Venus. So I'm going to say to you, Water Signs, please look at your birth chart for your Venus location. Uh, Venus is um, like Jupiter is husband. Venus is uh, what you find attractive in a mate or what you um, will be happy with or the person you'll be happy with most likely. So you can check that out. I feel like Empress is also wife. Okay. So I feel like, let's see what this two of swords is here. This is about, you know, you're not really talking. You guys aren't really talking about this two of swords. Yeah. So there's not really any movement between you, but I feel like the universe is moving you in a direction that will make you happy. Okay. That will make you happy. Um, for some of you, you could be the one with a third party and you're ready to move on to go to them. That's the person you want. Okay. That water, um, uh, let's see, it could be a Sag energy, but really if you have, if you're with somebody who's really stuck, you're kind of done with it. So you might have a third party energy and that person is is where you're going to go. You might try to escape this situation, water sign, to go toward this Sag, somebody who you've recently met or somebody who you're really falling in love with. Could be could be that Sag. Let's see. What's this other? Seven of Pentacles. They are in love with their work. Ten of Pentacles. All about the money for them. Five of Pentacles. Maybe, and maybe that's a problem. 
Yeah, they're very controlling. And we're moving into Aries energy right now, which I talked about a lot in the air sign one. You might want to check that out. This is, um, you're kind of like done with this person. You're done. You want something that's happy and joyful. Okay. Moving toward happiness and joy. Um, while that other person just toils away at their job, you know, you're getting nothing from them. You're getting nothing from them. And, you know, the four of wands here, it's sort of like they're working hard, um, for money, eight of pentacles, 10 of pentacles, five of pentacles, but, um, I feel like they're leaving you out in the cold. They're at their job all the time. Their third party could be their job. Okay. They're like a workaholic and they don't, everything is about their job. They sort of plow themselves into their job because they think that's what you want. They think you want like the home and hearth stuff and you guys do no question about it. But you know, this could be you plowing yourself into your work because you're very unhappy in this situation. Okay. And you're going to get what you want. I feel like you are going to block them out. You guys are going to get blocked out. And there's this new person on the horizon. Nine of Cups, Empress. And the universe is moving you in that direction. Very much so. Okay. All right. I'm going to do an extended on this one. I'm going to get messages to you from this other person that you're dealing with. The one who's either burying themselves in their work or they have a third party. There's something going on with that person. Um, I feel like you're done with this person. Okay. All right, water signs. Link is below. I will see you over there. Don't forget about the live tomorrow.